Welcome back, Silver Howler Tribe. We'll be up with you. I'm doing good, and I hope I hope you are too. If you're new, like and subscribe to my channel, or not. Especially if you want to die, you should subscribe. Also, I know you probably are thinking, are you serious? Five more adorable but deadly animals? And my answer is yes. And here they are. Number one, the pufferfish. These are cute little inflatable fish. All you need to do is, is put your mouth on their mouth and uh, inflate them. I guess, I guess they can do that by themselves too. But seriously, they may look adorable, but they are not for eating. They are one of the most poisonous vertebrates and have the poison that flows through their body and it has been known to kill their predators. And they're not a fish to be trifled with. The body contains a toxin called tetrodotoxin. It not only tastes bad, but it also is 1200 times more potent than cyanide and can kill 30 full grown men. And if that isn't bad enough, there is also no known cure and it causes a slow and painful death by suffocation and paralysis of the diaphragm. Sounds like a lovely way to go. Number two, the golden poison dart frog. The golden poison dart frog is a beautiful little amphibian, but you don't want to kiss it. Not only is it poisonous, you know, I mean, duh, it's a poison dart frog, but it's one of the most poisonous creatures on the planet. It can kill up to 10 full-grown adult men. I hope there's a cure for that because if not, there's another critter that you want to stay away from, and I think all of the people that snore should not live in places where they're heavily populated. Number three, the giant anteater. Sure, they're cute, and sure, they eat ants, and they seem harmless. Well, maybe if they were hand raised. But if you found them out in the wild, they have a weapon, their claws. Their claws are razor sharp, and that helps them to get their food by breaking down the termite and ant colonies as well as big rotting logs and things like that with ease. But they can also disembowel you with one swipe of their paw. The lesson here is don't run up to a wild anteater or you might just get the consequences. Number four, chimpanzees. You may think of chimps as a fun animal to see and to be around, such as, you know, at a zoo and places like that. Well, they do build connections with people while in kept when in captivity they can be super sweet and caring but that is completely different from them in their natural habitat they are vicious and like to eat meat as well they have been known with people but uh, when seeing people passing by to do some pretty brutal things that are well pretty awful whatever you think of is probably what they've done number five the hippopotamus Hippos are gorgeous, funny looking animals, but are not one that you really want to run into in the wild. They, especially males, have huge tusks or teeth that they use to fight with, especially during mating season. With that, they are also very, very territorial and don't want anyone messing around with their space. Not only are they super strong and territorial and things like that, but they can run up to 20 miles per hour even though they are a big fat creature. So whatever you do, don't be a hippo. These are five more adorable animals that you don't want to be with. And remember, may nature always be on your side and have a great day.